Well, it's not in front of thousands starting after 9.30 local time, but to the dozens in attendance and the thousands watching at home, we welcome you to Indy 11 soccer here on from the near sideline. When Zotti, Pronali, can Martinez get there? He splits the defenders, wow. but could not knock it past Spangenberg. And let's credit Trevor Spangenberg. He's been a Budati. Asante. When Zadi got a hit oh, on and a finds goal. the back of the net. Goal number five. I'm not sure the smoke's going to work in the rain. Let's find out, shall we? Goal for the Indy 11. 1 0 in the 24th minutes. Spangenberg. But this ball. Oh my word, what a great serve. And the toughest thing to do is, is head it down. Keeper to make a save low like that, especially on this kind of a turf. There's nothing Trevor can do about that one. That was just a moment of brilliance from Sebastian Guenzotti, his fifth goal of the season. That Nico Brett, one of our great goal scorers in this league. He clearly is toward the top of the table of that conversation. Agadello slides it through and Prosper Kasim, but Kasim was offside. Great step. Great. Top 10 athletes from Alabama. You would, all, you would all think they're all football players. Oh, yeah. The final five minutes of half number one brought to us by our friends at Sherman Williams, official paint sponsor of the Indy 11. Flag goes up against Martinez. I thought he timed it well. And that'll be it. We'll see exactly the speed at which players, coaches alike, Want to get someplace warm and dry for about 10 or 15 minutes. We're going to come back and do this again with 45 more to go. Much like Trevor Spangenberg, we first saw Fanwell in his days playing in Puerto Rico in the NASL days. Good ball oh. here. Quinn is on side and could not get it past Spangenberg. Aiden did not get everything on that he wanted to. He was looking for a ninth of the season. Well, you've seen into the top 15 in terms of good turn by Robledo, however, could not keep it. He is down in a heap. Brett looking to kick it back. No wet bow. And again, Tripp spills it. Brett couldn't get there in time. It's Martinez that could not get there in time. And Martinez, they're doing it's difficult to do because you've got to manage personalities. But the respect that they have for each other and the willingness to do the work to make sure this team wins is evident. Corcoran steps in, Lindley got in the way, ball goes wide, goal kick. That was really kind of the first turnover by the Indy 11 that Birmingham was quickly kind of able to pounce on. It was Corcoran that instigated that from the Birmingham perspective. And Indy's such a you know, possession-based team, but... Another critical match for Indy on Saturday against Miami. Asante charging forward, holds up the run. Wenzani finds him on side. Looking back post, Wenzani! <laughs> a two for Sebastian Wenzani. Solomon Asante gets his 50th assist in the USL Championship. It's time to cue the smoke one more time in Indy. Two goal lead for the home team in the 63rd minute. He's found it twice tonight. It is a brace for Wenzani for the first time in an Indy 11 uniform. He now has six on the season. Back-to-back -back matches with an assist for Asante. And again, the goal-assist combination got him to 100 on Saturday. He is now a member of the 50-50 club in terms of goals and assists in his spectacular six years of playing in the championship. As Hardy Souls in the BYB putting their hands together as best they can. Pronali got there to steer it away. Quinn redirects. Asante, Dispay, Asante. Martinez! <laughs> Make it three for the Indy 11. The home fans had to wait two and a half hours tonight. They've been waiting for offense at home like this all season long. All of the season. Give Asante the assist. Remember, he has had three assists in games before. He had three in the Open Cup victory against the Michigan Stars back in early April. And Martinez does just enough to get. 
4-0 at Charleston, 3-1 at Pittsburgh. And again, this is the part where I point out, as DuPont streaks forward, and poked away by a match that was played late in the season. Yeah, big confidence match, not just to come away with the three points, but a clean sheet would be important as well. Back post, Martinez will take a hit. And Martinez steers it wide. Smith working around Dambrot. Nothing there for Nico Brett. Legion in danger of losing a third consecutive match. And they've, they've been streaky at times this year. Brett takes a turn and Trilk is there. Wow, well handled. It's been a good night for the veteran of this league, but first year member of the Indy 11. Have a hit from distance. Wow. Trilk. Dan brought out, and our substitution's brought to us by Jiffy Lube of Indiana. Blake. Velasquez. Molina just checked in. Oh, wow. How about that for your first touch of the match? Ball finds Molina. He gets his second goal of the season. First time he scored since Charleston. And oh, by the way, the Indy 11 match, their highest goal scoring output of the year, also from that Charleston match. Make it 4 0 Indy here in the 90th minute. Where it was going to be difficult for him to be able to cut it behind the defender into Molina's space, but he's able to swivel his hips and get that ball perfectly into the path of Molina. As the best wins of the season for the Indy 11. For the first time since May 20th, all three points at home. Below.